Today we'll be learning an easy method created by Nvidia on how to set up GeForce Now on the Steam Deck. From gaming mode we want to switch to desktop mode and open a web browser. Here search for Nvidia GeForce Now by pressing the Steam and X button together to bring up our Steam keyboard. Click on this result for Nvidia's website and we want to access their download section where we can scroll down and find Steam Deck and download the file. In our downloads folder we want to double click GeForce Now Setup with R2 and Extract. Close this window and open the extracted folder. Inside the folder double click with R2 on GeForce Now Setup and select Execute. A command prompt will appear and we want to select OK to continue and wait for the script to download Chrome, perform the required setup and add GeForce Now to Steam. Once the setup complete prompt appears, go ahead and choose OK and access Steam. Here we want to find Nvidia GeForce Now from our library and select it from the list. Add to our favourites with the star icon followed by the manage symbol which is the cog and choose properties. So we can get cover art easily added and changed, we want to remove the first part of Nvidia by dragging with R2 and choosing cut and then closing the window. If you haven't already got Decky Loader installed then open your web browser and with Steam and X open the Steam keyboard and type Decky Loader and press enter. Access the first result shown, select download in the top right corner, access your download folder and double click on Decky installer. We will be prompted for our password for the Steam Deck, which if you haven't set before, we can do so easily by accessing system settings, user management and assigning something easy like Deck or Pass for now. Type in your password for the Decky installer and choose OK on the prompt that appears, which yours will say Install instead of mine which says Update. Once finished, Press OK and return to gaming mode. Let's access our favourites or non-Steam category and find GeForce Now and press A. So we can add cover art, enter the quick access menu and choose the decky icon and enter the store in the top right. Scroll through the apps listed until you come to Steam Grid DB and we want to install this. Go back to GeForce Now and using Manage we will now have the option available to change artwork inside gaming mode for all our games and apps which are provided are named correctly we can go through and set to our preferences. Before launching access the controller icon and choose Edit Layout. Go down to trackpads and we want to change right trackpad click to left mouse click. So select the right trackpad, choose mouse from the top and change to left mouse click. Go back a few times and let's launch GeForce Now for the first time. We will be greeted with the following login. Go ahead and make a GeForce Now account on your phone or computer or if you have an account already select login and access geforcenow.com slash login. Type the code and access the prompts that appear. After a few brief moments the Steam Deck will be registered with our account and load into GeForce Now. We can go ahead and start connecting our other accounts from Steam, Ubisoft, Epic Games and Xbox all to our GeForce Now account to increase the size of our library. I recommend checking out the settings included and having a read through the different selections available to us if we ever need them and go back to games. We can play Fortnite, Call of Duty, Destiny 2 and Lost Ark as well as many more 
which are all inaccessible on SteamOS due to their anti-cheats, but with GeForce Now it's possible and works really well as long as your internet connection is fast. I hope this guide was helpful getting set up with this new script by Nvidia, and if you're like me and totally new to GeForce Now, trying it out for the first time, let me know what you think about it in the comments below, as I am quite impressed with the results overall. I'll leave you all with some gameplay for 10 games running on GeForce Now at their highest or high settings with the Steam Deck. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a like and subscribe to the channel for more tutorials in the future. Until next time, thank you very much for watching, have a lovely day, and I'll see you later.